Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Kate Kami and today we're going to be continuing our Let's Play series in the game Palea. If you're enjoying this series, please don't forget to like this video and consider subscribing to my channel for more of my videos and streams. So, last time we did um, quite a few of the friendships. Uh, we, we unlocked the level 4 friendship quest and we kind of completed a Gina's quest. So I kind of promised that this episode today was going to be all focused about Tish. So we're going to do Tish's friendship request and I've been wanting to do some furniture crafting for a while. And so I kind of want to get caught up on, not really caught up, but I want to complete some of the sets. And so we're going to go through and this is going to be a heavy crafting episode. We will do Tish's level four story quest. But that's kind of what I'm thinking right now. So with that, we're gonna start off like we usually do, and we're going to we're going to do all of the um, the wheat. That's what we're gonna do. Sorry, I gotta think here for a second. What am I looking at? So we are going to get some food. I guess we'll get three. We'll drink whatever that is. <laughs> Mystery food. There we go. There we go. So this should be a pretty chill episode of furniture crafting. And yeah, whoops. That was rice. We want wheat. Look at this one here. That totally forked my uh, train of thought. <laughs> Anyways, I think we're just going to sit here. We're going to do some just general crafting today. Something to kind of relax. Should be relatively simple. But maybe we'll redecorate the house a bit with whatever we craft. That was the other thought. And I figured once we kind of start unlocking more of these recipes or looking at them, we can kind of decide what exactly we want to do. You know, we can come kind of come up with a plan for the house, so to speak. I do want to extend it. I want to make it a little bit larger. We are just about done with all of the story stuff so now we're kind of on our own well we got to finish some of the friendship quests i guess we're not a hundred percent done but we got a few things but this should give us at least a little bit something to to do for a while there we go There we go. I'll grab this one as well. I mean, maybe we start looking at how to, I don't know, best optimize, make the most gold. Maybe we uh, go for all the extra plots. That's a thought. I do want to start working towards the achievements. That is something I really do actually want to do, want to uh, complete. And so we'll start taking a look at achievements here after we finish, after we get our chef, you know. We'll do some romance, we'll look at all the achievements, and we'll see what we can do. We'll try to hunt things. But maybe that'll be in the future. That's the kind of, that's kind of my plan for the future with this, in case you are wondering. Because I know the story is just about, we're kind of caught up. So... Let's go, let's do corn next. We've got a lot, of, a lot of ears of corn sitting there staring at us. Let's grab those. There we go. Oh, that was the wrong one. All right, we'll do right here. Good, there we go. I guess we're gonna do the carrot next. <laughs> and four. I think that was everything. Yes, okay. This one. But anyways, should be relatively simple. Today should be kind of quiet, maybe not as much reading. So, I don't know. We, we shall see. We shall see. I'm 
curious to see what Tisha's uh, friendship quest is. She said she had a plan for dealing with uh, Rath. Rath's been sneaking off helping uh, Zeki with some deliveries and stuff for reasons I will not spoil. I guess he'll have to... We'll, we'll, we'll discuss it more when we get to Rath's uh, level 4 quest. I'll, I'll go over that history. Um, but... Yeah, so he's helping Zeki out with the um, Grimalkin cartel. And so he's kind of stuck there. So Tish has a way, she's trying to think of a way to help him out, to get him out of it. She might be a little mad at us for not telling her he's part of it, but I'm not going to rat him out. That's not my business. I'm not going to get in the middle of family squabbles, right? We're not going to cause the drama, <laughs> so to speak. So, now I'd be happy to listen to it and maybe watch it, but no, we're not gonna. We're not gonna start it. So we didn't tell her. She's a little upset at us, but that's okay. It'll be okay. But she says she has a plan, so we're gonna go and once we're done with this, we will go and see what that plan is. Um, onions, that's what I'm looking for next. Boom. Onion. There. Got another onion. There we go. And I guess potatoes are next. Got a lot of stuff here to harvest today. Let's see. Potatoes, potatoes, potatoes. Taters. Taters. There we go. There's one, two. Oh, yeah, I really got a lot. My goodness. I mean, it's great, but. Whew. Four. Easy peasy. Yep. There we go. One. I think that'll take care of that one. I do have one tomato. Whoops. One of the tomato, not the... I think that was peppers we just harvested. Oh, good. Uh, we need more food. Uh, five. We'll eat whatever that is. I think that was a steak dinner. There we go. Yep, we gotta do our... I think that's bok choy. So let's put our potatoes away. Move this over. There's our blueberries. Let's grab the bok choy. So I'm pretty sure, yeah, I think that's what this is. I don't think the cabbage... No, the nap of cabbage is not done. So, whoops, eight. No. This button. We will get there. We do need to repair some of our stuff too, so that's a thought. All right, I think we got everything harvested that we can. I'm gonna start here. We're gonna work our way around. We have everything a good water. There we go. We gotta start thinking of ways to make gold. Not that we really need a whole bunch, but I would, if we're gonna start doing some of this other furniture, well, I'd like to buy some stuff from Zeki's underground shop. I'd like to get some of the uh, wallpapers. Maybe we do that today. That's kind of Tish focused. We'll finish up Tish's uh, wallpaper collection. This is going to be the episode of Tish. That was kind of the, the goal today. So, we'll see. We'll see what we got. We have nothing in here. We got a lot of wheat seeds. Okay. Let's put... Well, we only got 21, so I guess that's going in there. Man. Rice. Okay. 
We got our cabbage. There we go. And we got some tomatoes. Okay, so what do we need? We need at least one carrot. We'll put one carrot in there. We need one onion. We'll put an onion in there. Oops, just one. There we go. Oops, and... No! Shoot! I did not mean to do that. I will be right back. Oh yeah. And we are back. I can't believe we did that. You know, I always hit escape one too many times, and that's kind of what happens. Alright, so we got that one going. There's our onion. This is pack what we wanted to do. Yeah, our wheat and our rice our ratio is really screwed up. We have to get that looked at. We do need a potato. We'll add that to the list. <clears throat> Probably need two corns. Oops. Two. Done. Yeah, we'll take one rice out. And then let's see. I think everything else looks pretty good. I'm kind of happy where the rest of the levels of seeds and stuff are. Is this our rice? I think this was our rice. We're gonna put 30 in there. This was our wheat. This one here is an extra that we might just end up getting rid of. So we do have some more jam. Always great, because we've been using that as focus food. So we'll sell the nine, we'll keep the 30. Sounds fair to me. We'll put some blueberries in there. This one here is the pickled tomatoes. Okay. We will put, hmm, we'll put some potatoes in there. I feel like we're running really fast. This is bok choy kimchi. Ooh. 2,000 versus, what does this go for? 4,000. Hmm. Not as good as, uh, not quite as good as the uh, apples still. And then we need one more. What else can we, what can be jammed? I guess we're waiting on the jam. Would like to do the rest of the apples, but I mean, we could. I usually wait till we get to about 30. I'll leave that one open as well. How's our worm farms? We haven't checked this guy in a while. Oh, we do have some more mushrooms. We'll put some more mushrooms in there. We'll grab the um, fertilizer out. Uh, we'll put those back. Oops, I can go up there. Where's our worms? We'll put our worms back here. We'll take the 200s. There we go. There's that one. How's this one looking? Not bad. There we go, we have 100 glow worms. We will sell, let's sell the 100 of, of this. We'll sell the nine of that. We may sell 100 glow worms. Do we sell 100 glow worms? Do we keep 100 in here just for us and then sell the 21? Maybe that's what we do. We gotta figure out what to put in there. We need some glowworm food. That'll work. Probably not the best of choice. I bet you that jam, this jam probably would have worked better, but. That's okay. Yeah, four versus. Yeah, that's okay. Still 9,000. That'll get us to what? 113, six? 689? That should do it. That's not too bad. Let's check our fox. Hey, buddy. And we got some more fine arrows, which is good, because I believe, yep, 66. We needed some fine arrows. All right. Let's read our mail. Oh, mystery blueberry lover. If you remember, we did the blueberry quest. Dirk Kami, thank you for the tasty, my friend. Thank you for the tasty, friend. It was the tastiest tasty I ever put in my tummy. Unfortunately, my tummy hole got big again. So please bring me more tasties for now. I hope you like the gift I made you. There aren't many tasties to find here, but I really tried hard. A mud pie by the mysterious blueberry lover. Oh no. 
Do we have to? Okay, maybe we have to bring another uh, another pie. Uh, sure. Oh, family matter. Dear Kami, stop by the inn when you get a chance. I heard back from my son. That's Ashura's level four quest. Oh, we'll do that next time. We'll do Ashura's level four quest, and then we'll try to get um, Sifu's level four quest. That's the that'll be next time. So Zeki, we got the coin. Okay. Next episode. To be continued. So what do we do with this mud pie? Is that a decoration? Cannot be sold. A gift from the mysterious blueberry lover. Oh, I know where we can put it. Let's put it over here on our table. <laughs> it needs a mud pie. Sure, why not? We're going to put it... See? Oh, I can't zoom in. Bummer. Yeah, we'll put it right here. Sure. Can we, we No, we can't zoom in. I wish I could zoom in on it a little bit. Because it does look kind of funny. Yeah. Good enough. The critter's going to have it. Alright. What do we have in here? We are somewhat good. May put a hundred there. We'll take a hundred. We'll get some of those going. We might need a lot of log planks. I get the feeling. So we might as well get some of this stuff started. Okay. There we go. We should be good there. All right. Tish will be up here in a little bit. No, it's only 2 a.m. She won't be awake for a while. So we're going to... She's asleep right now. So we're going to do a little bit of this furniture crafting. Actually, we're going to try to get some music going. Because, yes. Absolutely, yes. I know. You know what? Let's go to Zeki's real quick. Let's spend our coin. Let's buy something from him real fast. Because that way we get a coin for today's login. We can find our chapa pile. See if we hopefully maybe get a recipe. That's the reason why we, we, we're always checking. Or decoration of some kind. And then, yeah. Hopefully by that time, Tish should be awake. That's the thought. That's how we're going to do this. Maybe we'll buy the wallpapers at Tish's shop too while we're at it. So our first stop is Zeki's. So quiet in town. Here we go. We'll buy something from the shop. Let's buy... No... Maybe we'll buy f flour? Sure. We'll buy some flour. And three, two, one. Let's see what we got. And we got yellow crackling fireworks. Alright. Not quite the best, but it'll do. It'll do. Let's go looking for a chopper pile. What is that? It's a bug. It's a bug, it's a bug. Is it over on the other side of this bridge? I think that's just a gold bug. Star quality bug. Yeah, bummer. So... Sometimes the chapa pile can be over here. I don't see it by this tree. Oops. Okay, I'm going to pick up some spice sprouts. Don't see it over there. Could be around the hills. Should grab some of these other bugs. Probably not a bad idea. We see a chop pile over here? Not yet. Keyword is not yet. Okay. Well. Hmm. 
Nope, that's that bug. There it is, straight ahead. Chop a pile, dead ahead. I wonder what this bug is. Oh, it's just another butterfly. We're good. Thought maybe it'd be a rare beetle. There is one rare beetle we do have to get. We just got worms. Aww. I'm gonna see if it's spawned. We're still waiting for Tish to wake up, so. It's still incredibly, incredibly early for her. We are looking for the Princess Ladybug, or the Princess Beetle. And it's going to be kind of by the shore. It tends to be over in that direction, close to the water, or the lake here. So we're going to run along the coast, and we're going to see the shoreline, and we're going to see if we can find it. That is our goal. If we do, great. If not, great. It's just a way to kill a little bit of time while we're waiting for Tish, essentially. Ah. Nope. We're looking for the rare variety, too. If we see one, we're hoping we can find a star quality. So the one with the glowing... This is interesting. These ruins are always fascinating. Oops, nothing there. Just gonna keep looking. There's a chopper. We might as well grab some of this. I mean, if we're gonna grab things. Right? Nah, yeah, maybe not. Maybe we shouldn't grab it. If we're gonna get Tish's wallpapers, we're gonna need inventory space. Oops. I see shiny things. I'm like, ooh. Alright, do we think? No, it's not 6 a.m. yet. Tisha still is uh, sleeping. Man. The market's closed, though. Let's see. Well, I don't think we're going to see any, which is kind of sad. We picked up one, you might as well pick, them and pick up the rest. Ooh, star quality that. Ow. I don't think we're going to see too many. Okay. Well, it is one of the rarer bugs. Maybe it doesn't show up till later. No one knows. We'll just make our way back. Nope. You never know what you're gonna see. All right, let's go to Tish's, Tish's shop. Yeah, we got we got some room. We got some room. We got some money. Let's go do this. We're gonna do this. To the furniture shop. Hey, what do we got here? Modification kits, yep. These are all the wallpapers and floorings that we've purchased thus so far. We do have a few more left. Not too much. Well, yeah, actually, it's quite a bit. <laughs> I feel like they've added quite a bit. That's okay. 
we're gonna purchase what we can. Maybe we'll sell some stuff over at uh, Zeki's. We'll sell the worms and some of the other stuff we uh, we got. But we're just gonna pick some of this stuff up. Okay. This is pretty. Um, yeah, might as well. We can do three more. We got one more in here, guys. It says stupid moss. We're gonna sell some worms. Hey, Yanni. Guess what? We got we got business to do here. We got some business. Sell the stack, yes, please, and we'll sell this one too. That way, we got some room. Let's get that last wallpaper. We finished buying all of the wallpapers in Tisha's shop. Guys, we did it. <laughs> and we're not bankrupt. I just remember when we first started and we had all of seven gold to our name. Yeah, some of these are just really neat. And I can't wait to be able to get this stuff in the hat, into our place, be able to do some of this. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. All right, let's see, where is Tish? Well, there she is. She's in the clothing shop. Let's go talk to her. She's talking to Jell. Or, what are you doing here, Tish? Oh my dragon, you're here. Good, you came. I was worried for a second you wouldn't. I'm sure Reth told you this whole thing is my fault. I was so stupid to think it was really just the fresh air that made me better. I knew that people don't just get better from the sort of sickness I had. I should have known the glowing flower he told me to wear every day and never take off had secret healing properties. Oh. So what are you going to do? Hmm. I've got to figure out a way to get him out and you're going to help me. All right. Well, I guess spoiler alert. She, uh, she knows. I found this magic stone in Reth's things. Based on what I found in the library, it's called a singing stone. And it's sort of a listening device. I want you to place it in Zeki's room. That way, we can listen in on him until we hear something that can, that can get Reth out. Sounds stressful. You've got to get close enough to him that he gives you the key to his room. I've heard he's been trying to rope the humans into some kind of get-rich-quick scheme. Maybe you could pretend to be interested in that. Alright, we'll attempt. Were you able to slip the singing stone into Zeki's room yet? Not yet. No, I don't mean to pressure you, but I'd really appreciate it if you could do it soon. I heard a watcher's coming to town soon, and if they catch my brother working for the cartel, I don't think he'll see the outside of a prison cell for the rest of his life. Oh no. Well, that's terrible. Let's get together again soon. Well, okay. So I guess we're gonna plant the singing stone into Zeki's room. So we gotta find Zeki's house. Uh oh. Zeki's house is over here. We gotta wait for Zeki to be gone. Hmm. We are going the wrong way. I was gonna head back. I don't want to put our loot away. We got such great things. Hey, Oni, want some fireworks? <laughs> no, I bet you Najuma would want the fireworks instead. We're gonna let's take a look at the wallpapers because we just got them. Then we'll go plant the listening device. We gotta wait for Zeki to wake up now. It's too early in the morning for those guys. Way too early. All right.
Decorate your home with star quality fish, insects, and even food. That is true. Grab a drink here while, uh, while we're waiting to load. Oi. Three, two, one, here we go. Um, let's, we're gonna put the fireworks away. We're gonna put the flower away. Put this away and this away. The rest is all fun stuff for us. I'm just gonna kind of rearrange some of this. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Let's see if any of these are tickle our fancy. I do like the, our wallpaper though right now. I actually really like the wallpaper we have up. But let's see what we get for science. Um, I'm looking for a good blank wall. Eh, I guess we'll just do this right here. We'll just see what we get. So, our first one, number one. Oh, that's a flooring. That's the brick flooring. Ah. Kind of good in like a little warehouse thing. We could put it in here. We could have a brick uh, floored. Kind of doesn't go with the colors though. We would have to change the colors of everything. That's not bad. Okay. Two. Ooh, there's a color. That's a really busy wallpaper. Although it does look kind of fun there. Hmm. What do you guys think? Accent wall? <laughs> All right, uh, three. Oh, that's a floor as well. That's kind of cool. That looks nice. I do like the white tile a little bit better. But this would actually look nice in here. I like the pattern. Because then the rugs kind of break it up. Could be interesting. What do you think? That's a thought. Not so much in the bedroom. Okay, four. It's kind of cute. I like the flowers. They're kind of fun. I guess if you're really into pink, right? It's very spring. We'll leave it at that. Uh, let's, see. let's do what five? Could go this way. This is oh a darker blue version. Do we like the light blue or the dark blue? The light one almost goes a little bit better with the tile that we have versus the dark blue, right? This wall tile. I think the other one goes better with it. Hmm, that's a tough choice. Okay, uh, six. It's another wood. Not bad. It's kind of a pattern. I don't like the wood in the kitchen. I think I like the other one better. I think I like this better. Um, that might look good in here. Actually might look really good in there. We'll take a look at that. Uh, next one. Ooh, that's another tile floor, almost like another copper brick, but only instead of like long bricks, these are like squares, like plates, you know? Be good in like a workshop kind of room, I think. Two. We got some small tiles. Put it that down in there. Kind of looks like a pattern, kind of doesn't. Kind of like the other one. Ooh. Would that look better? It reminds me of cement. Oh, that does look nice. I 
That's a thought. Keep that one in mind. Three. Oh, there's a green version. <laughs> no, that's a no. Four. I do like that. It's kind of a nice wallpaper. If you want like a different kind of accent wall. I like that it's kind of darker on the bottom too. You know? Let me put it right here. Hmm, that's a thought. Five. This one here has the pattern kind of at the top. Oops, that actually looks good there. I wish it was a little bit different color because that actually looks really kind of nice. Not bad. Hmm. Would definitely be interesting. Okay. Six. Oops. Nope. Six. This one here, the pattern is going to be kind of closer to the bottom. Almost like a Liberty Fabrics kind of look to it. Uh, or at least that's what it, if you, if you know Liberty Fabrics, which I doubt you do, but if you ever play with Liberty Fabrics, this really reminds me of that kind of a pattern. It's kind of funny. It's kind of nice though. It's kind of cute. It's a little something different. Something, something for the bedroom. Okay, uh, seven. This here will be a top border. Okay. Definitely unique. Okay. And eight. This is going to be really busy. Yeah. Whew. That's a lot of pattern. <laughs> Maybe that's just me, but Whew. definitely interesting though. Doesn't quite go with anything that we have in here though, so that may have to wait. Um, I think we did that. Four. Next up is this. It's a very kind of pastel y kind of pattern. This actually might look good right there. You only see it when you come out. No. It's a thought. Five. It's a big blue pattern. All right. Looks almost like a mural up there. I like this though. That kind of looks uh, very oceany. <laughs> I don't know. Six. Ooh. Oh, now that could be really cool. I like that. It kind of goes with the green that we have. You know how we have this? It kind of, kind of ties with that. Does it look like a close with all the stuff? Mm. We could update some furniture. Move the heads on the wall. But it is really neat. I do like this. Maybe not there. Do we like that here? No. This side of the house. It's actually not bad either. All right, it was just a thought. And let's see, seven. Okay, very muted. Very kind of just soft. I do like that. The pattern is not so bold that it just kind of takes over. I actually do like that. Uh-oh, we lost our... We lost our wall. Dole. Um, control. Yeah, let's remove that wallpaper. 
Maybe that did it. F, um, oh shoot, let's just finish this. Seven and eight, because we are at our last one here. That's kind of neat. I actually really like that. I didn't think I was gonna like this one. I actually really like that. Ooh. Ooh. I could see like a whole, ooh. I like that too. <gasps> Maybe not there. But I mean, that just really makes those colors pop. Really neat. Okay, let's grab our. Oh no, this one here went back. Okay, Whew. thought we were gonna have to grab our furniture again. All right, let's put all these away. Are we happy with our selections? Eh, for the most part, yeah. I would say so. All right, let's go find, um, let's sneak into Zeki's house. Now that the important stuff is out of the way, let's sneak into Zeki's house. <laughs> uh. Should be fun though. We got this, right? We got this. Two Zeki's. Then we're gonna do some furniture making. The trick is we gotta find Zeki's house. I think he is out this direction. In fact, I think this is it right here. It's right by the windmill. Zeki, dude, I'm sorry to have to do this. But we gotta get Reth uh, free somehow. Is that a book? <gasps> she got a bug? Oh, I wanted to see what Buggy had. That's a really pretty. I like this uh, pink, this picture. That's a cool picture. Can okay, I take a look? Oh, he's got Full Metal Chapa. What's this? Looks like a corna festival or a fall harvest festival thing. <gasps> He's got spice sprouts in there. See him? Can't read any of his books. You know what? We are going to slow our roll. There we go. Let's, let's do our RP walk. There we go. Now I don't feel so bad. He's got a lot of fisherman's brew down there. Those always look cool on the table. I like his little bar setup. It's kind of cute. He's got a stove, a little chopping block. Can help him cook. Some stuff over here, very modern-ish. This house is decorated pretty good. Nothing good for us, no good recipes. Can't open his fridge, man. That's all we want to do. I do like the bookshelf. The bookshelf's kind of cool. With the actual book books on it. Alright. Let's go to Zeki's room. I think they want us to place it over here. Oh! Mama's crab gumbo. Ooh! Hope you're doing all right in Calamel, kitten. I got your letter about wanting to sell my old gumbo recipe and thought I'd send it your way. Flour, oil, oyster, chopped crab, spine shell is always your favorite, chopped onion, spicy pepper paste, but not too much. Give it a few stirs and while it cooks to get things missing. Things mixing. P.S. I know you don't actually want this for business reasons. It's okay to just ask in the future. That was this book. Oh, okay. I thought we were... 
Nope. Maybe we'll put this over here. Hide it, hide it in the planter. Yes. We'll do that. Ooh, we got another book. <gasps> Poem by an unknown scoundrel. Shiny baubles light up my eyes. What a charming mark you'd make. Don't be fooled by my disguise. Your brooch of such impressive size. A path towards you I start to take. Shiny baubles light up my eyes. Lo and behold my elegant lies. As I am such a handsome rake. Don't be fooled by my disguise. That ring, it sparkles like the night skies. It's light in which I yearn to partake. Shiny baubles light up my eyes. But wait, there's more. A delightful surprise. A wonderful deal I'd like to make. Don't be fooled by my disguise. What other trades might I devise? All your treasures I'd love to take. Shiny baubles light up my eyes. Don't be fooled by my disguise. Oh. I think we read that one already, but still. Uh, let's we'll go back to RP Walk just so we can kind of take a look. He's got a whole bathroom thing here going. Piping. Man, he's got it all set up. He's got shirts and stuff in the thing. He's got a bathtub. Man. Seki's living the life. I'll tell you that much. I like it. I like this big old uh, aquarium too. Oh, and there's a picture of Zeki up there at the top. <laughs> I like it. All right, we're gonna we're gonna have to head out. Return to the village. Let's go talk to Tish. Do 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 do. Uh, this direction. Ah. Uh. I do like the fountain. We need to learn how to make the fountains. Alright, let's go talk to Tish. There's Bedrew. He's our spuddy. I love Bedrew. Hey, Tish. Oh, it's really good to see you. Can I interest you in any new furniture? I placed the stone. Great! Now we just have to wait and see what we can learn. I don't know if we can find a way to help my to get my brother out of this mess, but I know I couldn't do it without you. So we got 90 renown, which is awesome, and a special uh, chest. Okay. If you can dream it, you can achieve it. We can. And now we can. We got another person we can. Add to our Shep list. Now we have to be careful we don't misclick anyone. That would be our luck. <laughs> I kind of want to get friends with the... Not everybody, but the majority of the people before we decide on who we want to be our Shep. I think that's going to be super important for us. Kind of debating, debating between a couple people for Shep status. I really like Delilah, but I also really like Bedrew. Bedrew always makes me laugh. And so, but Delilah is so sweet, and she's loved by everybody. So, I'm kind of, kind of torn between those two. But we will see. Uh, we have another chest, so seven. Let's take a look. Ooh. I like this. It's like a trunk. It's like a wardrobe trunk. Let's see. Can we fussy place it? Hmm. Not as well as what I'd like to. Maybe we'll put it right here. How do we feel about it right there? I feel like this room is getting really, really busy. Oh, no. You know what I mean? We could put it right here.
But yeah, we gotta start. We gotta think about how we're gonna do this. I like this uh, cabinet. Yeah, we gotta start building things. All right, now that we did Tisha's quest, we're gonna start building things. We keep saying we're gonna do it. Right now, we're gonna do it. So first thing we're gonna do, escape. We are going to take a look at where we are in the cooking or furniture crafting. And so I think we've completed log mat, log cabin. We've completed the harvest, village, farmhouse. I think industrial is going to be our next one. And we're just going to kind of make our way through this list. It's kind of where, what I was thinking. So I guess our next one is going to be industrial. So we will do that next. Um, we need some food because I am, I do want to make sure we are eating and leveling this up good. So we will go to, we'll eat a quiche. Oh my gosh, that did not do anything for us. Oh, ooh, escape. No, not escape. Inventory. 335, four, 375. Okay, so there, there. We'll switch those two. All right, so now we're going up in uh, focus before we start sucking down jam. All right, so industrial. What do we need for our industrial set? Let's go to never crafted. Let's go down, oh, well, not that. Let's go furniture, never crafted. Okay, let's go to industrial. H, come on. Industrial. All right. So we have the industrial armchair bed. Oh, we did all those. Right? Those are the ones we did craft. Okay, so maybe we need these ones ready to craft. Whew, I was almost bad. Let's see. Let's do the chandelier. Since we only got so much glass and so much light bulb. All right. Oh, good, 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 good. We got a little bit more we can do. Uh, let's go here. Let's go never crafted. Let's go down to the eyes for industrial. Where is that? We can do this one. Nice. One wall lamp coming up. And we got the industrial bookshelf. Okay. We will finish this set here really quick. Not sure if I really like the industrial set. I'll be honest. I'm kind of looking forward to something a little more our st this style, the style that I kind of enjoy doing. So, but we'll, we'll, we'll get there. 38 out of 30. Hmm. Kitchen pantry might be nice. Actually, might look better than the other pantry we have. And it requires glass panes. All right, let's do it. There we go. Can we make anything else right now? Never crafted. I don't think we can. I think, uh, yeah, we need some more wood. We need some more glass. We need some more all sorts of stuff. Let's make some glass. Let's grab some wood. There we go. Another set of logs. Let's see what we can do now. Here, never crafted. HI. Well, we can't make the cabinet. Oh, we need more glass. Okay, that shouldn't take too long though. We got the industrial bookshelf. Yes, please. And we're going to get the never crafted eye for industrial. We're going to get the industrial wardrobe. Oh, we lost our focus. So two. There we go. We've completed 100 weekly challenges. Hey, that's kind of cool. How much longer on this? Seven minutes. Ooh. So here's the question. Seven. Do we like that light? Or do we like this style of light? Here, I'll put them on top of each other. 
That one or that one? I kind of like the bottom one. Not gonna lie, I kind of like the bottom one. Uh, nope, not the homestead. I want the industrial. I want to pick up the industrial. Yep, G. Okay. But, would the industrial light look good? Maybe inside. That's something to light up the doorway. Just trying to think of something to get more light into this, this place. We could put it right here next to the shelf. Would it be in the way of cooking? Probably not. Maybe not as bad as, say, the rest. Let's grab this. Maybe we put it over. Ooh, can we hide it? <gasps> Hold on, here's a thought. Can we hide it back there? Can we, can we, can we? I don't think we can. Bummer. I was hoping we could, like, we could put it, like, right there. <laughs> That's what I was wondering. Can we hide it back there? Let's see, can we? I don't think we can. Yeah, I don't think we can. Bummer. Be nice. Grow light for the plant. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess we're kind of stuck. It's okay. The industrial lights do put out a lot of light though. I do like that. I like the idea of it being, you know, just something to add a little something. Uh, Z, that's what I'm looking for. You know, we're gonna have to think about that. And that's definitely gonna be a think because I actually kind of like that idea. All right, six. We got the chandelier. Do we like that chandelier? This one. Kind of like the copper one, not gonna lie. Copper one's already won my heart. We could put it up here. Might put out more light than this one. Let's see. Hmm. Not exactly. All right. Let's see. Eight. The pantry. Ooh. It's about the same size, and it's got the little thing next to it. Could we fit all our stuff in it? Do we think we can? See? Let's open it. Oh, can we open up the drawer as well? Nope. Just that. Okay. So we got three shelves. And it's not nearly as wide as this one. So we would have to take care, but I like that this one here doesn't have the ugly stain splotches on it. If you know what I mean. Hmm. Maybe we get better shelves. I kind of like our, our look here. I mean, we might be able to do like the first three rows, which would look really cool. This bowl here would have to, we'd have to figure something out with it. But we could place stuff on top. We could put the bowl on top of it, actually. Let's move this whole thing. Let's see what it looks like. There, let's go there. Close. Uh, no, there, there. Well, maybe we won't be able to place it because of the door. Yeah, that might make it a little difficult. Is 
See, can we like fussy? Well, we could, right there. It would look like that. Do we like that? I think we're gonna go back to our old uh, design here, however this was. Truly 45, I think it was this way. I believe we had it back like that. There we go. Yeah, I get the feeling it's gonna have to go like that. Yeah, this place is just so dark. All right, what else do we have? One, industrial bookshelf. Ooh, it's actually got books. Ooh. Could we put the bookshelf in there? Bookshelf would be kind of cool. How about a bookshelf? We got this. The bookshelf would actually look kind of neat. open this. We're gonna go... Let's pick this up and let's put the bookshelf in here. Yeah, let's do that one. I kind of like this idea. Because then we can actually put things on the shelf, which could be really kind of fun. Yeah. Don't really care for the dark would, but we can, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of dig that. And then we can put other knickknacks and things like that, of that nature in there. In fact, we can even put our trophies on there. So two is the last thing, and that is our wardrobe, I believe, which is huge and a big fat no. All right. We'll put those away for right now. Not too shabby. It's getting there. I feel like we need more plants. <laughs> Do you ever get the impression you just like want more plants? Is our, is our glass done? Yes, we got our one glass pane. We can finish off this industrial set and be done. Here we go. Here. Never crafted. I for industrial. Oh, no? What are we missing now? Bricks. Man, I thought we were doing good. Clay bricks. Sure. Oops. Where did it go? Did I just move it? Yeah, okay. <laughs> put two in here just in case. Just a placeholder. Two minutes. All right. We're getting things going here. We can do it. <laughs> Our one weed. We'll weed the garden while we wait. No, we won't. We are done weeding the garden. What did we get in the mail? Oh, just our Zeki coin. All right, lame. go let's go spend our Zeki coin while we wait for the um, the the machines to finish working here
Here we go. We're not gonna talk. We'll be good. As much as I think we really need to. We'll be good. Hey, Zeki, how's it going? Should we talk to Zeki, though? Oh, look what the Ormu dragged in. What do you want? I hear you and Gina opened up a new area behind the Phoenix Shrine. Pretty impressive. If you happen to find any glowy rocks in there, let me know. Ooh, rocks in the shape of the constellations? Yeah. yeah, exactly that. You see, those things are called flowstones. They're made from the fossils of dead magical plants and animals. Ancient humans used to use them to power up their cities. They're extremely powerful and extremely valuable. That's Sounds enough good. jabber for now. You know what, Zeki? We're gonna buy some. Three, two, one. And let's see what we got. Spice sprouts. Not the worst thing in the world. I mean, we need some, but still. Not the best either. You know what? Let's. Let's look for one bug that only comes out at night. And seeing how it is night, we're gonna go see if we can find it. That is that Gossamer Veil Moth. We're looking for a star quality version of it. If we happen to see one, we are gonna go crazy and try to find it and catch it. Usually spawns in this general area. We've had some luck seeing it in other areas as well. But since we're here, since we're waiting, I was not as prepared as what I thought we would be. We might need more wood, too. That's okay. That's not one. Just do a quick check. Is that one? That might be what we need. Nope. It tricked us. Is that one? Is that the same one? No, just a different one. Alrighty. Nope. Is that? Nope. Alright. We're gonna head back. I'm gonna see if we wasted enough time. Should hunt down all these choppas. Alright, where's our. There's our mountains, so we're going somewhat the right direction. luck with the bale moth over on the um by the ruins off there to the what is that to like the southeast that's usually where i've seen the uh bale moth kind of have a hard time finding it um in that spot but you never know sometimes you get lucky and you get to see it and sometimes you don't So we're going to make it through one collection, which is great. We'll put the spice sprouts away. We will grab our bricks. We'll put them in here. Let that do its thing. There we go. Let's do this. Let's finish this uh, furniture. Oh, I'm excited. Industrial cabinet. Yes, please. Get this done. There we go, we've crafted every industrial decor item. So, what is next on our list, our crafting list? Ravenwood is next. Ooh, not too bad. 
See, I kind of like this fancy set. That's what I'd like to maybe decorate with. I think that would look really nice. But I also want to see what all of the sets have to offer because I think each one offers just something a little bit different. It's kind of unique. So we're going to do Ravenwood. And we're going to see what all... Whoops. We're not going to do that again. We're going to see what all that entails. Actually, you know what? Let's put together... Let's take a look at our last uh, item. Uh, what is it? Six? Oh. Okay. It likes to sit in the floor, apparently. That's odd that it's not... Oh, it's a wall shelf. <gasps> uh... Ooh. Hold the phone. That could actually look good there. I kind of like the other one better. I like the little curved design, but we could always use another wall shelf. We could always use a wall shelf. We could put, we could do like upper cabinets. That would be kind of neat, right? Hmm. I wonder if you could. I wonder if uh, it would evenly space out or not. To do uh, uppers. Mm -mm. I do like this idea though. You know? So then you have your thing with the... Or we could replace this shelf, the open shelf there, with this guy. No, not what we wanted. This guy. If I place him over here, I just want to see if he opens up. Can I put things in him? Mirror, yes. We can put things in him. That's actually kind of cool. That is kind of neat. So if we ever redo this kitchen, which we probably will, that's a thought. Hmm. thinking we're getting ideas see this is why I wanted to do all the sets I think it's kind of cool to see all right so our next group in things we have never crafted no what was it investigator no moonstruck no ravenwood yeah this is what we have Ooh, that's gonna need a lot of iron Iron, glass, iron, more of the wood. How much iron do we have going here? We need more iron. <laughs> we got 50. 50 might not be too bad. How are we looking here? We got at least one. How are we looking on uh, planks? Not good. Hmm. Alright, we're going to let that do its thing then. Actually, we should take what we have. Let's take what we have. Sure. Let's throw some more in there. We're going to let that thing go to town. And just to get like a couple more iron bars, just because we need them. We're going to start doing that. We may need to go iron hunting. But we're into Ravenwood, which is great. We could make the candelabra. We could make the candelabra. Let's make it. Let's see what we get. Ooh. Let's do 
Let's do this. Small end table. Why not? Only because I think it might be something we can actually craft. Ooh, we could do the, this end table though too. Console we can't do. This could be fun. Sure. And you gotta remember we can dye all of these as well. So it is something to think Woo! about. The floor cabinets. I think that's gonna make a big, big difference. We'll grab the small end table. We'll grab whatever this thing is. The vase. The lavaz. What's that? Ooh, 12. But look at it. It looks cool. Huh. We could make the floor cabinet. Let's do that. I mean, it is a really neat set. We'll make the flowers. Not that I really want to, but... Oh, we can't make it. Darn, I was trying to pick things that we could actually make. Oh well, let's see what we got. Can we put any... I'm not gonna put it out here. Six. It does look kinda cool though. <laughs> Just because. can't put it there? That must be the arms. <laughs> oh, that's funny. But hey, why not? If it works, right? I do like the sun table. I think the sun table is really kind of neat. It's a little dark. It is actually really dark for my taste. But it is kinda. I think if you dyed it, it can look really neat. <gasps> Ooh, we could put our little uh guy on it. Let's do that. Where should we put that? I like him there. Alright, let's put that down. Can we, do you fit on top of this? No? Oh, well, that's a sad day. Bummer. Alright, maybe we won't put, place it on there. Alright. We'll pick it up. G. Done. And eight. The small end table. The trick is, is you can't place anything else on it. That's the issue I have with it. Can almost scoot it underneath there though. Hmm. I don't really care for that either. I was just messing around. All right, let's open this up. We'll put these away. Oh, we do have the, uh, this guy. Oh, he's tiny. <gasps> it's tinier than what I expected. Oh, I kind of like it. Not gonna lie, I really kind of like it. Does he open up? No. Hmm. I kind of like him right here. I'm not gonna lie. Let's put him. It's kind of centered. Yeah, I actually really like that. Let me put something fun on there. Maybe not the tea set, but we'll find something. Yeah. Yeah. I 
I like it. What's on here that doesn't belong? Those candles. <laughs> Seriously, a thought. All right. What are we missing? What do we need? What are our next items? Ravenwood, the console table. We need glass. For the flower planner, we need more of ceramic. And then for the vase, we need a lot of ceramic. And we need more wood. Okay. So how's our ceramic going? It's going okay. Let's go mining. Let's go pick up some raw materials for ceramic and for our pick is looking good. Our axe is looking good. Okay. For the, um, we're going to go chop down trees and we're going to go pick up, um, clay. That's what I'm trying to say. We're going to get ready. We can do this. We can do this. We're staying oddly focused today, which is good. We're more focused than usual. How about that? We have a plan. We're going to run up by the Daya family farm and we're going to run basically from one end of the lake all the way down. And we are going to collect as much clay as we possibly can along the way. And then for the iron, and we're gonna collect iron and we're gonna collect trees. And we're gonna make a pit stop into Bahari Bay where we can find both of those items. So that's what we're gonna do. That's the temporary plan. No, no. Hey, Nayo. Hey, Delilah. I really want to talk to him. We are focused today. Hey, if we complete at least, we completed at least one furniture set. That's good enough in my book. I am happy about that. I'm actually really happy about that. And we'll look for our bugs. If we happen to see our little ladybug that we need, we will definitely be grabbing one of those. Hey, someone caught a surgeon. Nope. I just hope we end up getting all of the uh, clay that we need. So far, we haven't seen any. Let's grab our little pickaxe. That way we're ready to go. Nada. Huh. It's kind of surprising. Usually it's all up and down this coast. got about half of these, which is great. That means we'll get credit for the mining together as well, which is exactly what we need. There we go. More quartz. That is a big tree. There we go. You know, it's actually not a bad idea for the mining together achievement. I mean, if you know you need it. There it is. There's a star quality one too. Oh no, you don't. Come here. Oh 
no you don't. Come here. Don't you get away. Hey, there we go. Got our princess ladybug. Figured we'd find it. That one was worth going after. I believe that one will help us with our bug catching. Our, right here. Yep, that was our one bug that we are missing right here. There's a few more things we're missing. Night moth, the rainbow butterfly, the fairy mantis is one of these, and I don't know what the other one is, and I, I think this is a regular Bahari bee? Because that's a golden bee. So there's a few things we still need. But then we'll have the uh, star quality bug catcher complete. Which is exactly what we need. It'd be good. It would be good. We just got to keep working at it. Little bits every time. I love these purple flowers. I want to pick those purple flowers. I want those purple flowers in my place, man. Those are nice. They're so nice. Let's see. Can't do any more that way. Uh, any more? Maybe that other person uh, grabbed all the clay. On this side of the Bahari of uh, Kilima. try around here. Sometimes you do see some around the lakes. I know it spawns around here. I hear something with star quality. Yeah, it's just the... Okay. They didn't go far enough. Haha. <laughs> oh, maybe we're just getting a respawn. Hey, that'd be great. We will take a respawn. How much do we have? 72 so far. If we can grab a couple hundred, I'd be happy. Don't know if we're going to get that far, though. Oops. Take a look around here, see if any respawns happened around the lake. I'm not seeing any. Alright. I think we are heading over into Bahari Bay. We're going to grab some lumber and some iron. And then when we come back, on our way back, we'll do that loop again. Just go in the other direction. And we will try to um, pick up what we can. And that's our exit. And we'll just grab whatever we can along the way, on the way back. Maybe that'll double our amount. We'll get into like, what, 144? Be happy with that. That should get us at least a little bit more. Alright, so we want pine trees and we want iron. So pine trees are going to be, oh, well, they're kind of all over. We'll just kind of roam around. We'll do a little bit of roaming. See what we see. There's some iron. Oops. There it is. Maybe we'll get lucky and we'll find one of those moths. Or a bee. Or a mantis. Or something else entirely. Who knows? Get the 
this one? Oh yeah, this one's too big. Yeah. That one's a permanent fixture. We chopped enough trees. I don't see too much iron though. Which is sad, because usually this area is kind of loaded with iron. Maybe we'll go this direction. I am looking for that mantis too. If we happen to see it, we are jumping. But, I'll be honest, I think it'll take a lot for us to see it. More plant fibers. Good plant fibers. Uh, we need food. That little guy. There. Let's move our, shift all our food down. There's our iron. We'll put the quartz right there. Put that right there. That way we know what we're going for and whether or not we're being successful. Iron? No iron. Not an iron. Someone's got something marked. Oh, palium. Yeah, we'll get the palium. Only because it is a rare resource. We're right here, right? Oh, I think it's up. Maybe it's up. saw it. It was right there. Where were we? thought it was right there. Must have disappeared. That's sad. Oh well. That's what we get. We shall continue with our, uh, original plan here. There we go. 115. Actually more rock than iron, but we'll take it. There we go. Any iron here? Yes. We'll take that. We'll take the garnets too. Hmm. We need a direction. I know we're gonna need a lot of wood. A few stacks won't hurt anything. Ooh, better be. Yeah, we need a rare version of that bee. That's something we're looking for. That is something we are definitely looking for. 
we're going to keep our eyes out. We do see one right... Where is it? I heard it. Yeah, there it is. It's just that. I hope. Some iron right here. wander this way a bit. Iron? Iron. Big iron. Let's see if we see any more of those bugs we need. Yeah. Call it the eight iron. Oh, there's some palium. Ha ha! Someone's hitting them, marking them, and watching them disappear, I guess. We got a ruby, because we fell prey to that one. Grab this one. more over there. Looks like it's all starting to spawn. Good. Because we needed some. Thirty-eight? Man. I think we're really getting screwed on the uh, iron ore here. We're getting gypped. That's okay, we're gonna level this, uh, we're gonna level this up. Anything up here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. useful because it's going to help us get that buzzy jar that we want. And those buzzy jars really help us find those rare bugs that we are looking for. Or at least I hope they do. <laughs> it seemed like it worked pretty, pretty much last time. I had fun with it. It was kind of fun to, to mess around with. Do we see any of the bugs that we need? How many bug balls do we have? We need more bug bombs. All right, note to self, we need to make more bug bombs. Okay. And we can do it, but hmm. That is just regular. Anything else? We're just looking for iron. Do we need more trees? Yeah, we'll grab a couple more trees while we're at it. Might as well. We're here. Yeah, we'll grab this pine tree too. Since we need the pine trees so bad. Here we go. They will 
we'll head towards Tamales. Oh, hey, there's another bee. It's a star quality. It is not the star quality we need. We're not going to waste our five. Just in case we get lucky and we find one, that is a star quality bee. We want that perfect bee. If we're going to be out here chopping wood, we might as well. Right? That's the way I see it. We're going to go look for iron over in this direction here. Is that iron? Yes, it is. Good. Just what we needed. See any more? Not exactly. <laughs> Some iron here. There we go. Anything on the side of the wall there? No. It's light across. So yeah, this is kind of a, a little bit of a resource heavy day, but that's okay. We, we kind of need to do some of this stuff. So I'm afraid we're going to run into our bee and I'm going to miss it. I am really worried about that. <laughs> I know we don't have a lot of bug bombs left and so I'm like really, really worried. Iron? No, that's just regular stone. We need this one. There we go. Is there anything on this side? Sometimes you get lucky and you find um, heart drop lilies right around there. Or at least you used to. Oh, we gotta do that little statue quest too. We got that. back through here. Gathering is doing pretty well. Surprised we haven't gotten that much in mining, but I guess we haven't really done a lot of mining excursions, have we? In all honesty, we really haven't. So... I guess we're going to start changing that. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Apparently everyone's after it. Oh, we can get our- we can fast travel back to our house. <gasps> I forgot about that. We can do that from through here now. Ooh, there's a thought. Then we miss out on the, uh... That's okay. It'll be okay. I say, then we miss out on the clay that we need as well. Yeah, you are. Good. Mind what we can. Try to hit up some of the places we know about. Places we haven't been yet. <laughs> Maybe we've been over here. Let's go up there. Oh, hey, Tamala. 
just because we aren't over here. This neck of the woods? Darlin, back so soon. Why, I might start thinking you enjoy my company more than my potions. I don't need your company, but it would certainly be appreciated. And she wants heat root. Lovely kick. Yep. I'm sure I'll be seeing more of you soon. Um, you might. Make it up. Yeah, we made it. Don't see any more iron. I guess there's some over there. There's a lot of iron over there. I guess we'll go get the iron over on this side. Oh, looks like this person might be getting the iron on this side. That's okay. We're gonna help him out. We're gonna go up this way. Get like this one first. We know they clicked on these. I don't want them to despawn. iron do we have now? We got 110. Alright. 117. It's better than where we've been, right? Is that another one? Or is that just regular stone? I think that's iron. haven't seen running around here lately? Mujin. Remember they used to be like everywhere? You couldn't like get away from them? They were literally everywhere. I haven't seen a single Mujin around in a long, long time. Why is that? Where did the Mujin go? I mean, they literally were everywhere. It was kind of annoying. Jumping in and out of the trees all the time. Now you don't see them at all. I mean, call me crazy, but... Yeah. That's something I've noticed. Where did the Mujin go? We should look that up. We're gonna have to look that up later. Next episode, we'll have an answer as to where the Mujin went. Maybe we can, uh, that's a mystery. Like, seriously. They're all gone. I'm waiting for this mine to do something. Do have some ore here. Anything else over this direction? No. There's one back here in the corner. I mean, we might as well grab them all while we're running around. But yeah, it's kind of odd. I don't see any of the Mujin. Oh, we may not make it. Shoot. <sighs> oh well. Anything up here? No. <laughs> we'll just glide this direction. I'm sure we'll be fine. But yeah. Usually you see them wandering all around. Like, this used to be like their roaming rounds, you know? I mean, I know the rare version of it was kind of a pain in the butt, but... One too bad. And no. Yeah, we haven't seen this. How long has that been? Huh? 
Hmm. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to look that up and see what we find. This one here may just spawn soon. There we go. I'll kinda go around this way. Remember this area used to be like a thing? Oh look, another one of these guys. I explore to become lost. In those moments, I find myself again. I'm not here yet. And we got these little strange canisters. No Mujin and a strange canisters. Some kind of visual bug. Alright. Um. Question is, do we go back the long way and pick up the other stuff along the way? The rest of the clay. Half of me says yes, because we need the clay. <sighs> But it's a long run. Well, not really that bad. We just gotta... As long as we stay focused, we can do it. The only way we're gonna get sidetracked is if we see something rare that we don't already have. And we won't even go through the right ways, too. Flow tree or <laughs> Paleum. Those are our conditions. If we happen to run across something rare, though, we will we will make it a point to to stop and check it out. Ooh. There's a Paleum. Yep. All right. We'll take it. I'll take it. Take it and run. Hurry before they catch us. Run. Do, 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 do. All right, let's get our last little bit of clay. Then we're done. We're just gonna run along the stream all the way back around. We're just gonna grab what we can, whatever we see. This guy, hopefully we see something. not looking good right now though. I'll come out and say it. It's not looking good. If it looks like someone's already grabbed it, we'll probably head back. This one here is, hasn't been touched. And done. Sweet. Is anyone... Yeah, this all looks like it's been taken. We're gonna go back to the house. We're going to put all this stuff into our stove and our furnace and that good stuff. I'm sorry you guys had to watch all of the mining, but now you have a general idea of how I go about doing it. Come on. Thank you. There. There. So let's see. 
that's another 12, 13, 14. It should be 26. I'm going to hang on to this. And in this one, we're going to do iron ore because we only got 29. I'm going to put the 36 right there. And we're going to put 100 in here. There. That should give us some. We'll put the gold away. That's worth 4,000. Wow. Can't believe it. It's kind of good. And then this here, we got 68. We have another 35. <laughs> we'll see what we can get. There's three, 155. Three and four. So I'll we'll just keep feeding this fire here until we're done. In fact, I may just take this, 32. We got 67. That's going. 25. Hmm. We'll put 71. Let's put 70 in there. There we go. Because that's going to take 10, so that's another 9 panes. So 6, 9, that'd be 15. That'll be good. And then the rest goes into our chest here. We are definitely saving this ladybug. I'm so excited. <laughs> and we got the ancient flow bug. Um, the Pahari Bee. We do have a couple of these. I think he's going to get sold. We're going to save our gems. And our silk. Alright. So I know there wasn't much happening in this episode today, but we did get kind of a lot of things set up for future crafting, which I think is great. I mean, it'll help us out tremendously. Um, a, to unlock all the furniture stuff, oh. and then B, just to kind of start working on our house. Kind of make it all, do it up all fancy-like. It should be fun. I'm excited. Oh, we got our fox here. And with that, let's see what we got. Some pepper seeds that we're going to sell. Man. Just a lot of little running little things to do here. But anyways, with that, I think I am going to kind of call it an episode. And next time we will take a look. We'll do maybe a little bit more furniture crafting. We will do Ashura's um, level 4 friendship quest. Because we do got to find out what his son said when he wrote him back. So that's really exciting. And then we also need to work on our friendship with Tish. I believe she is our next person that's kind of close in the friendship. Yeah, or Sifu, not Tish, Sifu. Yeah, so we'll get close to get unlocking Sifu's um, level 4 quest, maybe even Zeki's. So we'll start working on the friendships as well. So we'll do a little bit more crafting of the Ravenwood set. And then we'll, we'll do some friendships. So, anyways, all that's undone. If you managed to stick it out this far, thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. Um, and I hope you have a really, really great rest of your day. I will catch you all next time. Goodbye. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more content as it greatly helps out my channel. Hope to see you soon.